Bow hunters in North Dakota were busy putting up tree stands in August to get ready for the season opener for deer. Really recommend um, and encourage archery hunters whenever their, leave, their feet leave the ground that they're connected to that tree in some way with a, with a lifeline or a safety harness. There are some simple hunter safety tips to follow in upland bird hunting. Whether crossing a fence, um, unloading those firearms before crossing it or getting back to the vehicle loading and unloading give each other a lot of space. It's critical when upland bird hunting to maintain straight lines and know where other hunters are. In addition, wearing blaze orange helps hunters stand out. Waterfall hunters have safety concerns as well. Keep those shotguns pointing in a safe direction at all time, especially when people are, or dogs are out retrieving um, down birds. Keep those muzzles out of the ground blinds and keeping them pointing um, in a safe direction while the birds are approaching. Um, and keeping that safety on until the, the firearm, is, firearm is shouldered. There are lots of hunters hitting the field on opening day of deer gun season in November. I mean, just some of the things we see with deer gun hunters is just making sure we get all the way out of the vehicle before we load or unload our, our firearms. With most of North Dakota being relatively flat, being aware of what's beyond our target with those, with those rifles. Um, rifle bolts can go a long ways. Fall on the prairie is a busy time, not just for hunting seasons, but also for our agricultural producers. Uh, moving cattle closer to home, combining crops, it's just a, it's a, it's a busy time of year on the northern prairie and we just really encourage our hunters who are guests on a lot of private land and, and heading out in those rural parts of the state for, the, for recreational opportunities that we're not interfering with those agricultural producers who are getting their crops off or moving cattle. This is Mike Anderson in the North Dakota Outdoors.